Leo. Leo, let's get into a general for you. I apologize for the delay in getting these out. Um, just been sick with different things going on, colds, flus, whatever you want to call it. But hopefully you've had a good start to your new year. So if we look at your current energy, all of a sudden I'm exhausted. So I feel very, very tired with your read for some reason. Now, this can be that things have been very trying for you. It looks like there is somebody that you need to forgive, or maybe you have received forgiveness. This has allowed you to move on. Despite the questions that you still may have, it's allowed you to go forward even within that pain, which is a wonderful thing. So, excuse me, I'm going to yawn here. For whatever reason, this has been rough on you. It may have taken its toll. And we see the desire or something that you're wanting is basically all your ducks in a row. The good luck card is one of those cards where it's kind of, to me, it would be like the world card or, or something like that, where it's just everything that you're wanting. And not to excess. With the Hermit here, you're trying to figure out how to move forward in this. You're still waiting. It's almost like you're, you may even be waiting for the other shoe to fall right now that you've got your ass kicked and um, you're waiting for the next part of that. Could be that you're waiting for things to fall into place. Now the outcome is family. So for some of you, this can be that that stable nature of family, whatever family is to you. This head over heart idea that is really making things different, focusing on possibly education or planning a future. And as you start to make those choices, uh, we get the Eight of Wands, which brings in more messages. What's working for you is that things are changing. There is communication that may change how you feel about something in that it feels very solid. Now this could be any type of communication, but it seems to be with the 10 of cups here, something with a loved one. Now the 10 of swords shows up as what you need to be aware of, followed by the Knight of Pentacles. Now the Knight of Pentacles has been showing up a lot for signs lately. And this is staying on that path. Something's ended, and you're not sure if this is still the right path for you, especially when it comes to love. This could be that you've managed your emotions despite what is going on in your head. Now we have the Six of Cups, the Queen of Swords, and the Hanged Man. There's somebody from the past that you may be very guarded against, really not wanting to speak to kind of one of those individuals where you're like, yeah, you know what, past is past. But they could be coming around again. This could be you, this could be them. But you're very guarded, and you may need to look at that in a different way in order for things to change. So, Leo, that's what I have for you today. Best of luck this week. We'll see you next time. Stay safe.